Hello everyone, we have received a few trades uh, from our students that I'd like to share with you on the 18th of the May. AP shared this clip uh, that shows he shorted uh, this uh, four hours chart when the NASDAQ rejected, Did you see the macro structure here. So the uh, short is in this candle, uh, in 30 minute structural chart which is this area, this candle. So as you see the rejection uh, at this uh, dynamic and static uh, resistance area led the uh, very fast uh, downtrend uh, loss of the NASDAQ and all Eminis. They, they had big loss on the 18. So he went to the smaller chart and took a lot of positions and profit from this center of the swing so let's play his video he put uh, looks like two sets of 0.04 position on his trading accounts uh, which is a forex account uh, you and most forex brokers offer CFD on futures like eminis now you see how he uh, moves his position and you see this channel downtrend he moves his uh, trailing stop and lock the profit and try to manage it manually based on usually the trend line that you see here if this trend line breaks uh, he closed the position so now it's going with this slope and is accelerating and then now you see we are around 12 wow the, he got most of the um, most of the wave so he closed some of them here because there wasn't clear evidence that it will continue uh, but kept some there some runners here added new position here in the second wave uh, took profit here and again uh, this one as a runner still was kept. So he took the range of 12,320 uh, so till 12.076, which is from here to 12.090, around here. So he took this profit safely from the core of this downtrend and uh, that's how you get consistency and high wind rate because you identify a trend in a smaller time frame so this channel and then use this pull back pull back to take profit safely because the higher time frame buyers and sellers are behind the traders and push the price toward the targets so thank you ap for sharing this nice uh, trades and clip with us uh, next trade clip was shared by HR showing that he shorted USD Japanese yen. Uh, this is his four hour chart that we see downtrend and this is one hour chart and he went properly on this channel, good entry area, good exit in the middle of channel and big chunk of a one hour uh, chart. So. Mm, that seems to be about 100 pips on the gopher USD Japanese yen. So thanks HR for sharing this nice trade with us. Uh, then Easy shared pictures of two trades with us. He has shorted uh, Imini SMP that was falling also uh, like the rest of Eminis. So uh, SMP after again didn't hold this area of the previous uh, s resistance and which was support and became resistance fall badly very significantly. So it took opportunity to short around 40, 60, beginning of this wave. So he, in, he entered here using a smaller time frame, and you see his entry. A structural short uh, is 30 minutes, but macro is 
so four hours so we see also that is aligned with dynamic channel beside this static rejection at this level so he shorted as i said here very nicely he see the channel here now you see the channel in five minute chart and uh, so the previous channel was with this uh, slope so his entry was okay around this area stop loss was okay then uh, the he took the profit more than half of the channel and trail it because momentum was good so this was his first trade uh, that he took profit up to 30 here he took this chunk from 60 to 40 30 points of the S&P then uh, he sent this picture that shorted again this wave so this is the picture of second trade shared by EB the picture you show entry here around 3950 and target which is around 32 so another 20 point when the uh, 4000 level also rejected and the momentum of drop was very very uh, strong so he took profit in this area this chunk very safely using five minute chart and you see it's getting now close to the previous low and major support of the past um, level that got rejected so 54 to 30 he took this chunk from here to here again the last trade was shared by mf on us aud cad and this pair was in downtrend as you see he is uh, explaining in the clip four hours chart was downtrend here and then 30 minute chart also he shows downtrend so they are aligned high probability trade area the channel entry everything matched the algo four and five also entry signal is correct and he is uh, instead of getting profit in the middle of channel he is trailing uh, to get more around this major per past support area and that gives him much more uh, profit and uh, than the middle of channel because he's advanced trader most advanced traders um, do that and they don't uh, just get out all the position in the middle at the beginning they have to use exit strategy one uh, to get high win rate and exit um, all position here but when they get advanced they are allowed to use exit strategy two and three and do manual uh, manual management of positions so that's reason you see um, mf is doing that and many also senior traders thanks mf for sharing this clip with us and i hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions